Hey everybody, it's Jeff Duggins with H2O Designs. We are over in Richmond, Kentucky today, checking on this project we started last week. I think you've probably seen a couple of the um, photos going around on Facebook that Amy's posted. Check this out, guys. You've probably seen the old deck that was here. There's an old deck that kind of came out to where that concrete was. or some bricks on top of the concrete. We, we um, stripped all that off. Hot tub was existing. Really like the way the, the hot tub turned out. Let's talk about that for a minute. This deck, we shortened the deck down, but gave it a lot more usable space. Just a little area for the grill right here so they can hop right out the door and grill. Nice big plat wide platform step. Notice the lights that are right underneath of the step there. Those put off a really nice illumination at night and light up the, um, the area. Another, another couple coming off the patio there where the pavers are gonna come up to it. This hot tub area, I really like this design. We do a couple, we've done a couple of these over the years. It's got a nice smooth step transition up into the hot tub. Just a little tray area right here where they can set their drinks on while they're sitting in the hot tub, have access. So you don't have just a big flat bottom there. It makes the hot tub a lot more enjoyable and usable for that. Obviously coming out of here, we can already start laying pavers over this whole area. So they have a nice large area with a table and chairs there. Fire pit area going in the middle with our typical fire pit circle around it. So they have plenty of room for Anirondack chairs. Check out this wall, guys. I thought this looked really awesome coming off into the landscaping and the, and the yard this way. A little bit of a high step on the back side, but that won't be the main access area where there'll be chairs and stuff around the hot, or uh, sorry, the fire pit area. So just a nice transition for this um, for this backyard from a drab, drab deck that was pretty much unusable by the time they got the, the table and chairs and grill on there. So they had no room for relaxing. Pergola served no purpose that was there. There was a pergola over top of that little patio area there. Served no purpose whatsoever since they don't get any afternoon sun. Get rid of that. It's going to be a nice outdoor living area. Should be wrapping this thing up next week. We'll hit you up with some finished photos. And we have actually have a couple of projects going on right now. Now around the area. So we'll hit you up with some more progress videos with this. Until then, hope you enjoy this. Have a great day.